printer scanner do it all? From document and photo printing to scanning, copying and sometimes fax capability built in. Finding the best printer can mean the difference between easy, high quality printing and clunky operation that results in smudged and blurry documents. In this video, we are going to take a look at the best printer scanner you can buy. Links to all products mentioned in the video are available in the description. If you have other products you'd like us to review, please tell us in the comments below or visit 9to5printers.com. Epson Workforce Pro WF4630 The Epson Workforce Pro WF4630 is a versatile all-in-one office inkjet printer that produces economical color and black and white prints. In fact, the firm believes its precision core inkjet technology produces superior prints at less cost than a comparable laser-based rivals. Like many Epson printers, the WF4630 has an understated design that works well in business environments, with the matte black plastic body and glossy black trims. Most of your interactions with the WF4630 will be handled through the 3.5-inch touchscreen panel. Thankfully, the touchscreen is easy to use with intuitive menus. The user control panel on the top also houses hardware buttons for the fax dial pad as well as quick copy buttons for color or black and white copies. Compared to the touchscreen driven interface of the competing HP OfficeJet Pro X series, the presence of physical buttons on the Epson makes the Workforce Pro WF4630 instantly feel like an office tool. The WF4630 doesn't have an SD card slot, but a USB port is conveniently located on the front for direct USB printing or saving scanned file to flash drive. Additionally, the printer supports printing and scanning using Wi-Fi from a PC, Mac or smartphone running Android or iOS. 2. Canon PIXMA TS8320 Canon's PIXMA TS8320 is pretty and sleek. Available in glossy black, red or white instead of the usual matte black or mealy office beige. It has a big and bright 4.3 inch color LCD touchscreen which makes it easy to use and keep an eye on ink levels which are displayed in real time. The TS8320 has 6 ink cartridge slots. Most all-in-one printers have only 4, which gives it a higher capacity, but which also means there are 2 additional cartridges to replace, increasing overall usage costs. Still, if you're looking for very high quality photos and pleasing overall aesthetics, the PIXMA is a great choice. Speed-wise it's average, but the PIXMA produces superior quality photos with vivid contrast and bright colors thanks to an extra photo blue color cartridge that complements the cyan, magenta, yellow and dual black ink packs. The rear paper feeder lets you load specialty papers, such as photos, labels or envelopes, without disturbing the paper in the 100 sheet capacity front tray. And the TS8320 can automatically shut itself off after a customizable amount of time and then power back on when you send it a job. 1. Brother MFC J5945DW Printer Because inkjet technology takes up less room than laser, Brother has been able to cram more paper and ink capacity into this fairly compact desktop unit. In fact, it can even print onto A3 sized paper, be that plain or glossy. It comes bundled with standard sized ink cartridges, but with high yield cartridges available and able to deliver 6000 pages, this MFP's running costs are actually lower than some laser printers. The lid of the scanner bed is also quite bulky because it includes a 50 sheet automatic document feeder or ADF. Even the compartment that holds the 4 ink cartridges bulges out from the front of the machine by a good few centimeters. Overall, the MFC J5945DW takes up quite a lot of desk space, but it is still smaller than a laser-based device offering all of these features. The color display and control panel are a good size too. The 9.3cm touchscreen is reasonably responsive and is set in a tilting panel that makes it very easy to operate. There is a convenient USB port on the front panel for plugging in a flash drive and another USB port inside the body of the printer. And that's the end of that chapter. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. It really grinds my gears.